How to get fish smell out of clothing, detailed guide. Looks like you caught a big one, but now you're stuck with the catch of the day smell on your clothes. Don't worry, this video will teach you how to get fish smell out of clothing and leave your wardrobe smelling fresh again. But first, what are the tools and materials you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get rid of that awful smell. Get rid of it! Rinse the clothing as soon as possible after it becomes stained or smelly. This step is important because the longer the fish smell has to set into the fabric, the harder it will be to remove. The sooner you can rinse the clothing, the better chance you have of successfully removing the smell. When rinsing the clothing, here are some tips to keep in mind. 1. Use cold water. Cold water is best for rinsing fish stained clothing because it prevents the smell from setting into the fabric. Hot water can cause the smell to become more deeply ingrained in the fabric, making it harder to remove. 2. Rinse thoroughly. Make sure to rinse the entire affected area of the clothing thoroughly. Pay extra attention to any areas that appear to be heavily soiled or particularly smelly. You can use a sponge or cloth to help remove the odor if necessary. 3. Add a mild detergent if needed. If the smell is particularly strong or if the clothing is heavily soiled, add a small amount of mild detergent to the water. This will help remove the smell. 4. Be gentle. Use a gentle touch and be patient when rinsing the clothing. Aggressive scrubbing or wringing can cause the smell to be pushed deeper into the fabric. It's also worth mentioning that if the smell is still present after the first rinse, repeat the process a few times. Doing this will make sure you have removed as much of the smell as possible. In addition, always check the care instruction label on the clothing before washing or rinsing it. If the smell persists, do the next step. Use a stain and odor remover. Once the clothing has been rinsed, use a stain remover specifically designed to remove fish smell from your clothing. You can find specialized odor removers for fish smell in many pet supply stores, home goods stores, or online. Each odor remover will have its own instructions for use. So, be sure to read the label and follow the instructions carefully. This will typically involve applying the product to the affected area of the clothing and allowing it to sit for a certain period before washing. A little goes a long way with these products. The amount you need to use will depend on the product you have selected. However, you'll only need a small amount of the product. Removing fish smell can take time, so be patient and allow the product to work. It may take several applications before the smell is completely removed. It's worth noting that not all odor removers are created equal. Therefore, always test the product on a small, inconspicuous area of the clothing. Once there is no damage, apply it to the entire affected area. Furthermore, follow the manufacturer's instructions carefully to avoid any damage to the clothes. Follow these instructions when applying any cleaning solution shared in this video on the clothing. Check if the smell is gone. If the smell remains, do the next step. Use a white vinegar and water solution. White vinegar is a natural cleaning solution that can be used to remove fish odor from clothing. You can use this option if commercial products are not available. To get started, combine equal parts white vinegar and water in a spray bottle or a bowl. The amount you will need will depend on the size of the affected area of the clothing. However, a general rule of thumb is to use one cup of white vinegar for every one cup of water. Next, spray or rub the solution onto the affected area of the clothing. Be sure to saturate the area thoroughly. Pay extra attention to any areas that appear to be heavily soiled or particularly smelly. Let the solution sit on the clothing for at least 15 minutes or longer if the smell is particularly strong. The vinegar will help break down and neutralize the fish odor. It is important to keep in mind that vinegar has a strong smell by itself, but it will dissipate after drying the clothes. Do the next step. 
Wash the cloth with laundry detergent and one cup of white vinegar. This step is a follow-up after using the vinegar solution or any other cleaning solution in the previous steps. This step will help to further remove the fish smell and any remaining traces of the cleaning solution used before. Select a mild laundry detergent that is safe for the type of fabric the clothing is made of. Be sure to read and follow the care instructions on the clothing label before selecting a detergent. Along with the laundry detergent, add one cup of white vinegar to the washing machine. Do this before you start the wash cycle. The vinegar will help neutralize any remaining fish odor. It will also break down any remaining traces of the cleaning solution used before. Next, wash the clothing as you would normally. Check if the smell is gone. If the smell persists, do the next step. Add a cup of baking soda before drying the cloth. Baking soda is a natural deodorizer that can help neutralize any remaining fish odor in the clothing. To do this, measure out one cup of baking soda. This is the recommended amount for a standard washing machine load. Pour the baking soda into the drum of the machine. Then, wash the clothing as usual following the instructions for the previous step. Hang the clothing outside. Drying clothes in the sun is a natural and effective way to remove smells. This is because the ultraviolet rays from the sun can help neutralize any remaining fish smell in the clothing. This step is especially effective if the smell has been removed to a large extent, but there's still a trace odor remaining. Hang the clothing on a clothesline or drying rack in a sunny spot. This will allow the clothing to be exposed to direct sunlight. Leave the clothes hanging in the sun until they are completely dry. This may take a few hours depending on the humidity and temperature. Be mindful of the weather. If it's a cloudy or humid day, it may take longer for the clothes to dry or may not be effective. It's better to wait for a sunny day to dry the clothes. This means that the entire process, from washing to drying, is best done on a sunny day. Repeat the process. Fish smell can be a persistent problem, particularly if the smell has become deeply ingrained in the fabric. It may take multiple attempts to completely remove the smell, and in some cases, the smell may not be completely removed. After the clothes have been washed and dried, take a moment to assess the smell. If the smell is still present, it may be necessary to repeat the process. If the smell persists even after multiple attempts, it means the smell may be too strong or deeply ingrained in the fabric. In such cases, you may have to discard the clothes. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you liked it and found it useful. If so, please like, share, and comment to let me know what you thought. Your feedback is important to me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos.